And we're back, guys. Tennis in a minute. I'm your host, Get Energy. We're back in Romania. We have the round of 16. Russ taking on Elise Cornet. Bonjour, como allez-vous? S'il vous plaît. Magnificent. Beautiful, madame. Oui, oui. <laughs> Elise taking on Russ. Elise takes the first set. And Russ, uh, look, she's from the Netherlands. Look at her eyes, guys. She is possessed out there. She's got power, and she is aggressive. Russ is hyper, guys. I like watching her play. She's like Camilla Georgie. She's so freaking hyper with that left hand. She's, she reminds me of just an older Bernarda Para. Like, seriously, she's got some firepower. She's hyper. She plays so aggressive. I like watching Russ play. I really do. She's got like 30. 30 lower level championships taking on the younger player <laughs> right right something like that now this matchup Russ dropped the first set but I want to talk about Cornet in this matchup because you know I've said this in the past about players like Dasha Kina how long can Dasha continue at a pace like that so we're looking at Elise Cornet who wins the first set and she does that a lot she could not get the second set to go her way. She had her opportunities, but the third set, we saw her clearly run out of gas. Now, you can get away with this style of play being just a defensive powerhouse, returning balls, three-hour matches, overs every time you play, like Dasha in her mid-20s. But once you hit your 30s, you cannot play like that because you're playing against younger, stronger, more athletic, aggressive players and just just returning balls, not having the power to just really overpower your opponents and score when you need to or serve and set yourself up for easier service games, it's going to take its toll on your body. And we're seeing Courtney just there's no wraps on her finally, but they'll be back soon. And someone like Dasha, I just question the longevity. She's got to work on her serve and she's got to work on just holding serve a lot easier she cannot continue to just play three hour matches in three sets it's just it's gonna take its toll on her body and we're seeing that happen with Elise who has mentioned and she's talked about retirement when's it gonna happen me personally I want to see her play at least for another three to five years because this was a very entertaining match with the exception of the third set where she just ran out of gas and that's we see this with players like Laura Sigmund who just doesn't have it. That's just why Coco was upset. She sees her milking the second serve clock or uh, the absence of a second serve clock where you could just take as much time as you want while, you know, going several times over your initial serve clock. It's just you have to work on your tools to where you can beat opponents a lot easier without taking such a grueling toll on your body. Rush gets a victory. She's going to take on Anna Bogdan, who we saw take out Alicia Parks and Erica and Drev. I told you guys, she's overvalued, guys. She continues to be overvalued and the favorite in these matches. She doesn't really have it. I mean, look, she's a good player, but what type, what type of skills does she have to be? It's not like she's, you know, blasting 10 to 15 aces a match like Alicia Parks. You know, it's not like she's amazing at the net. It's, it's, it's just like she's a long rally player that relies a lot on her opponents to make mistakes. And she's not a good returner. You know, she can be broken. She shouldn't be laying this kind of chalk because Mira's winning all these matches. So we're going to see Anna Bogdan take on Russ. And Russ has never beat Bogdan. She's won a set off of her. So that's going to be a very entertaining match. Russ indoors, though, it's a different story. She's going to bring the pace to Bogdan. We're going to see if Bogdan can keep up. Tennis in a minute. Get your popcorn. What about Ons styling and profiling on Emirata Kanyu? That was great. I'm excited to see Ons. I took Ons to win that match. That was my personal pick. Stay tuned for more tennis coverage, guys. Tennis in a minute. Great day with tennis, guys. Amazing. We'll be right back.